Education Monday, Education Monday on the Tribal Root Studio with Alina Zahil. How are these refugees created? Changing mindsets in Africa, making a world better. Together, we can make a difference. We are fixing Africa. Education Monday. Education Monday. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Tribal Root Studio. And this is your friend, uh, Alina Zahil from Uganda. And I am inside the Tribal Root Studio in the Changing Mindsets program, the Education Monday. And today, I'm going to specifically speak about refugees. Uganda is a haven for very many refugees from different countries, Congo, Ethiopia, Somalia, Eritrea, Rwanda, Burundi. And I think we have the biggest number of refugees in the whole of East Africa. So we really are that country that welcomes those people looking for a place to refuge. And today what I want to speak about is why we shouldn't stigmatize refugees. Why everyone needs to wake up to know that stigmatizing refugees doesn't make us better people. So what I'm really speaking about is these refugees didn't choose to be refugees. They probably ran away from something you would also run away from if it came knocking on your door. I don't think they chose to leave their families behind. I don't think they chose to leave their relatives. I don't think they chose to leave their jobs. I really believe these people chose life. They chose to live. They chose to not have the comfortable life, but to have a hope for the next day. The reason I'm speaking about this is that I have met so many people who hate refugees with a passion. I have met a lot of people who would stigmatize them, who would uh, segregate them, and who would try to isolate them. And I believe we need to stop that because it is wrong on all levels. But saying that, I want to come to the bottom of the problem. How are these refugees created? How do they happen to become refugees? There's no one who is born a refugee. Everyone is born free. But these people find themselves in the situations they are in because of circumstances. So I was looking at the very many reasons why we have refugees. It's because we have an ending war and conflict. We have poor leadership. We have greedy people. We have warmongers. And these are the problems we have that lead to the creation of the refugee problem. So all the people that would want to uh, focus on the refugees, calling them the problem of the society, you would rather focus on the source of the refugee problem, which may be your government, it may be your leadership, it may even be you, it may be the policies, and it may be the reluctancy of us to all speak up and fight for peace for our neighbors, making sure that every country is safe. At Tribal Roots, we believe the Africans have a lot to share in common. Africans have a commonality factor. In finding you trying to segregate another African because they are from the next country 
and because they are refugees does not make you better it makes the situation even worse if we shift our focus in look at the reasons why we have refugees we will solve the refugee problem so refugees wherever they are they deserve love they deserve food uh, basic needs they deserve a roof on top of their head because they didn't choose to live in the camps in the settlement uh, they didn't choose to become refugees and we need to be compassionate enough to make sure they are loved accepted and most importantly if they can be helped to go back to their lands that is if peace is restored in their lands this is the tribal root studio and my name is Alina Zahir once again leave your comments below if you would like us to address anything please bring it forth and share and subscribe and making sure this message uh, is heard by everyone in the world for as we say every day that our tribe roots to the way are fixing Africa have a great day peace and blessings